One second. <laughs> this thing messing with me. Since we're doing B-type game, let's do B-type music. Secret tunnel! Secret tunnel! Hey, Millie. We're just gonna really quickly, hopefully, beat B95. All we gotta do is make 25 lines. Without dying. Oops, well that's it. <laughs> They go pretty fast. I don't think this one's going anywhere. Okay, try again. Oh gosh. Yo. Let's open this up a little bit. Quiet too. Let's turn that up just a bit. Okay. Try again. This is looking all right. Oh boy. It's looking less all right. Stop giving me those. Awful game. like the high levels of Dr. Mario. Yeah. 
Ew. Oh gosh. Whoa. <laughs> This one's looking pretty good. Cheese it! Robot house! <laughs> oh. Hello. Hi, bye. Oh boy. Oh boy. This looks my times too. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh man. Come on, here we go. There it is. Okay, that's it. We're done with Tetris. We got the space shuttle. Although technically it's not a space shuttle, it's the Russian equivalent. Yeah, space shuttle. That was way easier to get than 200,000 points though. Heavy Multiplication X. <laughs> game Boy. That was it. That's it for Game Boys, Eric. I hope you enjoyed the Game Boy seven minutes of this broadcast. Just wanted to do Game B95 to get the space shuttle. Congratulations. Thanks, game. <clears throat> How you doing, Eric? Oh, baby. Look at all those singles. <laughs> and two doubles. <laughs> okay. Let's get rid of this one. And this one. And let's bring out this new one that I made just for this. It's a square. As Brandon said, I gotta try this game called Fallums. That I guess is like a Columns clone. Okay, we need a window capture. There it is, okay. I heard it for a second too there. Oh, okay, it only has music while you're playing it. Oh, and you can't move the window, okay. All right, it looks like Columns. Music's pretty good. And with a name like Follums, I guess I'm not terrifically surprised. Okay. Simple enough. Yeah, it's, it's like Columns, but with a different style of pieces. Instead of a 1x3, you have a 2x2. Two two. That you can spin two different ways. Let's see if we can't get a five in a row here. Well, that's not going to do it. <laughs> so much for that plan. Oh, brother. Okay, there we go. There it is. Oh, yeah. Five in a row. Spinning it through like it does a mirror. <laughs> I used to play columns for... Uh, oh, it added a new piece for uh, Game Gear. Like, a ton. I loved it. Especially when it go all wild and you get these big combos.
Oh, a purple one now, too? Oh, what are these? Those look like they, they're not playable. Are those matchable gems? Or is that just trash? Oh boy. They look like... What?! <laughs> okay, they match with the wall! <laughs> Did not see that coming. Okay, apparently the wall's part of this game. <laughs> that was wild. Um, Alright, let's drop those down there. Let's make this board bigger. So can I, like, get over... Oh, well, that wouldn't have worked. Oops. Oh, boy. What are those? Are they anythings? What just happened to my game? <laughs> I don't even know what those did. Okay, I guess I can play over here now. <laughs> what? Those are part of the thing? This game's bananas. Am I beating the game? What's happening here? Look at all this space I have now. Oh no! More stuff coming up from underneath! That's no good. That's how you keep it interesting there, game, huh? Very well. Oh! There's no bottom there! Okay. <laughs> Games bananas. Uh. Oh, what? Thanks for the five hundred bits, mud too. <laughs> Just stopping through, showing some love to streamers who seem to be enjoying themselves. I am enjoying myself. Thanks for the bits. I'll make sure those get over to Treehouse. How are you doing tonight? It's awfully kind of you. Um, oh, whoops. Oh, I, that's kind of what I wanted. Oh, boy. So, it's not going to give me more floor, like... I've doomed myself a little bit. Life is amazing. Oh, that's great to hear. Oh, okay. Now there's some more floor down there, maybe? Well, that's fantastic to hear. Okay, you got to be careful not to accidentally destroy the game, apparently. Oh, my brother-in-law told me to play this game blind on stream. <laughs> and now I see why. <laughs> That was pretty fun. We just beat Tetris for Game Boy. And now we were, we're playing this one just to goof around. And then we're going to move on to Legend of Hirotonma. 
a game for the what? Okay, for the TurboGrafx 16. I don't really remember much about it except that it was really hard. Um, okay, it's getting a little out of control here. Let's blow up so that kills all the purples and greens. That's what that does. Um, okay, yeah, that's not not thrilling, but it's fine. Oh, no, don't do that. All right, yeah, let's get rid of this. Oh, okay. All right, let's get rid of all of them. There we go. Oh, bye, gems. Okay, so gems can't hold themselves up, but do we run out of music? Those blocks can. I miss the music. Are you coming back, music? Oh, boy. Oh boy, it's getting a little hardcore now. Um, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Okay. Ah, there we go. It's getting a little too close to the top. I hate it. Oh man. Oh man. Okay, let's see if we can't. Build some red here. Buy stuff. Oh gosh, that's really close to the top there. It's really, really up on there. <laughs> oh boy. Oh brother. I need a red. Give me a red. I can't even see what piece is next because that part of the game went away. It's no longer with us. Okay, here we go. Let's get rid of all the reds. Oh, except I did double red there. I shouldn't have done double red. That was maybe not advisable. Okay, get some of that out of there. And some blue. That's not going to help at all. <laughs> it's not. No good. No good. It's full of steam. Oh, oh whoops. I put that in the wrong spot. <laughs> Thanks for the follow. That <laughs> too. I think we're gonna die. Oh, I could have put that there. Might have been somewhat helpful. Um, what? Where we go, a game? What are we doing? We're just. This game is bananas. Um, what's happening? Is there a bottom? Did I just lose the game? Is this going to fall forever now? Oh, I can push down to make it go faster. Can I? Okay. There's aliens? What? And rocks? Now? Am I supposed to kill the aliens? Okay, we got some music now. Uh, uh, yeah. Mm. This game's amazing. Maybe not the best way to do that. Oh, baby, that combo. Um, okay, should we smash some more aliens or? The alien corpses become part of the level two? Do I have to match them up? I wouldn't even know how to. Okay. Um, okay, 
Oh, I can push them around. That's how. Oh. I can smoosh them. Well, that's interesting. Am I supposed to smoosh them? There's a triple. Okay, let's see if we can... Oh, whoops. Let's see if we can shove this one over there. Missed. Boy! Whoops! No! <laughs> <laughs> what is this game? Oh, you can't go through that purple stuff there. Oh, there, I got three in a row. Oh, it doesn't do anything. These aliens just interfere, huh? Do I even have a score? How deep does this game go? So if you have three aliens in a row, any match you do then makes them blow up. This is too weird. See if I can get this triple here. Ah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, wait, what? It just worked that time? Why didn't it work last time? Game, you are beyond my comprehension. I did not mean to do that. <laughs> this game is too weird for my brain. That's a bit upside down. That's not what I was trying to do. Oh gosh, I hate all of it. Okay. sure what I, I I want to do or I'm supposed to do. Maybe there is no want or supposed to in this game. Maybe you just do whatever. Let's see what's down here. Lots of aliens. Don't know what's happening down there.
Really, game? <laughs> okay. Oh. <clears throat> Alien combo. Oh. <laughs> What'd you do that for, you goof? That's not going to do me any good, is it? I can't get rid of that block there. I don't know. Let's go down here and see what's down here. Red ones. Red ones move up. Oh. Oh, no. And they stop your pieces. Oh, no. Did we just lose the game? Retry level? Restart game? What does level mean? Hmm. So I go back to right there. Oh gosh, watch out for these red ones. They're evil. Oh no. Wow. That was... Those red ones are awful. But like, how deep does it go? It was like slime? Massive combo! And we got like the Super Mario 64 underground music here. Not exactly. Legally distinct from Super Mario 64, obviously. Yeah, okay. What's there's like a chalice now? What's the chalice do? There's fireballs? This game just never stops inventing new stuff. Oops. Whoa. Gosh, this game has changed a lot since I started it. So can I, like, get that chalice, or...? Oh! 
Oh, it's destroying my stuff. Rude. I got a bomb now? That's all the bombs do? I expected so much more. <laughs> no! Oh, gosh. Oh, now we're talking. Dang. Ah! <laughs> Radishes. What's up, Mr. Bing? Do you want radishes? Oh, well, you came to the right spot. This game's messing with my head. No, I'm just another lurker. That's fine. Lurk away. Oh, you know what's funny is that I didn't even think about it. Um, the game has stretched beyond what you can even see, like, that's funny, because I put it in a square window. The game actually got taller. I didn't even notice. Like, when did that happen? So you can't even see the whole game, or it's getting, actually, you're getting it compressed. You can see the whole game, it's just squished on your screen. <laughs> on my screen, the game got taller. <laughs> didn't even realize. It snuck up on me. Oh man, yeah, you better finish. All right, you need spoilers? Where you at? I'll, I'll spoil it for you. I'm like an expert at Super Metroid. I've beaten it twice. And I remember beating it once. So. I sequence broke Kraid 2. I forgot to get high jump. Or I didn't know I was supposed to get high jump. Doing the Mickey. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, is that what it's called now? The Mickey. Nice. There are worse things to be doing, that is. I was also apparently the only person who thought Fantoon was an easy boss. I didn't have any trouble with Fantoon. Dragon messed me up a little bit. I mean, killed me one time. So, we killed each other the same amount of times. I did it with bomb jumping. And I was like, oh, whoops, should I go back? And my chat was like, nah, you're fine. <laughs> Just go. Just keep going. You'll be all right. Power bombs? I didn't need no power bombs to fight Kraid. What do you need power bombs for? Oh, in Norfair. Oh, brother, what have I done here? This is grouse. Oh, my goodness. I have created quite the mess. I think that's it. It's given me all the chances it can give me. Wild. All right, so let's do... Yeah, back at the beginning of the game, it actually is a square game. When did it get taller? Oh, man, that's why the game won't let me move it. Like, I try to relocate it on the screen, and it's like, nah, -uh, you can't. So we gotta get it to the point where it's giving us different gems.
And I don't know if points have any meaning whatsoever in this game. Okay, so now we got orange gems added in. Or yellow, that's not really very orange. Now we got purple jams. Okay, this is where the game gets real weird. Well, this is where it starts getting a little bit weird. And we start tearing out the wall. So I think my game did actually get whiter. When I wasn't paying attention. Oh boy. I don't even know what happened over there. Okay, now whatever I touch with this explodes, so let's get rid of all that. Alright, we'll do uh, yellow and red, I guess? No, let's get rid of this stuff. Now we'll do yellow and red. So is that... Okay, there's still floor there. Let's get rid of all these. Ooh, what's up, Twitchy Turbo? Okay, there goes my game. It's like gone now. Is there still a floor here? Nope, floor's gone. All right. How are we doing tonight, Torbal? Playing a game called Follums that I'm not sure even has an ending. I'm on level 49, apparently, though. It's a wacky game, though. Oh, whoops. All right. 
just when you think the game is over, it goes deeper. All right, let's blow up this in blue. Suffering? Oh no, that's not that's not okay. Don't be suffering. Cause we were suffering until suffrage. Sorry to hear that. It's a bummer. Oh brother. What are you what, what am I doing? What am I goofing around here for? Go further down. Okay, we got green aliens. Now we got rocks. Oh no. Created a situation there. Okay, that's fine. I'm not really sure. Like, if the game is even the game, or if you're supposed to just get to the bottom, and that's the game. We gotta see if there's a bottom, right? Now we got these red ones that get stuck. Oh boy, don't hit those. Because the real difficulty seems to be getting deeper. Oops. Okay, we made it to the green section. Oh, we gotta do a little digging here. This is the part that had the fire... fireballs. Um... Oh, this is gonna be a fun one. Let's not get it stuck right there. Maybe I should have cleared out more of that. Ah well, should have, could have, would have. Let's uh, let it go here, huh? That's nice. Take this bomb down with us. There's double chalices? What do these chalices do? There's skeletons now? Oh gosh. There's people picking up stuff now? Like lemmings? Okay, you're gonna pick up those treasures for me? Thanks. Oh, whoops. Oh, brother. Oh no. I put that in like the absolute worst spot I could have. Is he taking my points from me? Well, I've really messed this up. Oh, I killed him! What 
What is happening? I smushed him. Alright, get those out of there for me, please. And let's not get ourselves stuck this time. Oh, no. I need those rocks. Well, I guess these things will destroy that for me. Oh, here we go. Now we're talking. Yeah, that'll do it. Mm -hmm. Go that way. Thanks, Torbal. <laughs> Just wouldn't be a stream if Torbal didn't tell me to go that way. Okay. Yes. I'm not sure what exploded. Oh, missiles! Missiles exploded. Woo! Oh, no! Actually, will you carve off two of those for me? They'll make it easier. Hey! <laughs> oh, brother. Uh... Okay. I can match up guns? That's wild. Okay. Now what? Now can I destroy that? That's bananas. All right, let's keep it going, I guess. What else can we... Oh, brother, that's a lot of purple. Okay. Yellow. Green. Am I winning? You win. <laughs> what a fun game. Wow, we should have we should recommend that one for a high score challenge, huh? That game was wild. To stream it though. It's kind of tough because the the window changes shape as you play it. Ah, well, well, that was a fun game. Thank you for suggesting that, Brandon. All right, let's switch now to our Turbo Graphics 16. Let me get that all set up. Mm -hmm. Be right back. Okay, and then switch this over there, switch this to that, and there we go. We have Legend of Hirtuma. Okay. I have no idea how to play this game, I just remember that it was super hard. It's like, um, Contra, I guess. One player, two... Oh, you can do it two players. I wonder if you take turns. All right, we're in the ruins. Or maybe it's kind of like Jewel Master. Let's see. I got shoot and jump. 
So let's put shoot on turbo. Nice. Got some money. Money's probably points. Uh huh. Oh, that thing was buff. Ooh, P is upgrading my gun. Now I'm shooting little dirty clouds. Come out of there, you. You don't want to come out? Okay. What's up, Devastation? Uh, is this an upgrade my weapon too? Oh, now I'm like throwing little blue grenades? Do I have hit points? We played some Game Boy and we played some Fallums. Oh, here, let's switch this, I guess. Now we're on Legend of Hero Tanma. You think this is. Oh, it does have its own category. Okay, these little vampires got a little out of control here. This is gonna upgrade my gun again. Oh gosh, okay. Gun got even more ridiculous. Is that gonna upgrade my grenades? Now I'm shooting red fireballs. This guy is ridiculous. Oh, don't shoot me. Oh, don't lick me. That's even worse. Okay, my my shots were like going over it. That was not cool. Oh gosh, more liquors. Ah. Thanks. I hate it. Gross. Ooh, boss time. A lot of skulls back there. Ugh. Welcome back, foo. What the? Oh. Don't hit me with that sword, bro. Whoa, now it's shooting stuff. Okay, bye again. Stream game needs updated. I did update it. I put Legend of Hero Tama. Did I not hit done? Oh man, I lost all my power-ups. You died one hit. Okay. Oh, those are like heat-seeking missiles. Okay. Can I just run past them before they pop up? Ugh! Okay. Alright. Um, I, it's, I'm, that's probably, I'm not very surprised, I guess, so this is a pretty obscure game because it's on a pretty obscure system. Um, I'm surprised... Oh, okay, you got heat-seeking missiles, too. I'm surprised when somebody has heard of a TurboGrafx-16 game. Oh, you can jump on enemies like it's Mario. Does that mean I can jump on the skeleton? Wow. I didn't know that sub-messages showed up in that little alert box. Did you see how tiny that text was there? <laughs> Thanks for the sub-zero. <laughs> All right, now that we've got the full message in, let's give this a whirl. Oh, it didn't show up in my chat here, so I'm going to have to read it out of this chat over here. Super Tetris, Super Jurassic, Super Castle, Super Kirby's, Wondered, Alt... I always say Wondered there. All right, let me start it over here. Let me try not to say Wondered. Super Tetris, Super Jurassic, Super Castle, Super Kirby's, Wonder, Altered, Solar, Gargoyles, Excite by Castle, Genshin, Heroes, Honkai, Heroes, Chips, Boy, Adventure, Final of Final of Final Star, Jetman, Might and Star Makers, Binding Park Magic, A Battletoad, Smash Street, Contra Fantasy, Dragon Fantasy, Dragon Fantasy, Hunt Challenge, Science for Rampage, The Rail, The Impact, The Crasher, Adventure, Strategic Mario, Crafts and Trap, Golden and Fighter Edition, Sword Legend, Emblem Mystic, Lethal Bros, Dude, ah! I lost it there. 10-2-64-3-2-12-3. Parappa the Metroid, Island Quest, Winds Quest, Warrior Quest for Battletoads, Technology Rapper, Fire Beast, Company, Undertale, Warp Shit, Tonma. <laughs> Sounds like a game title invented by AI. <laughs> Doesn't it, though? <laughs> All right. Let's watch out for this skeleton's heat-seeking green projectiles. How you doing tonight, Zero? Okay, you can jump through floors. Okay, don't shoot it in the legs or it falls apart. You gotta shoot it, what, in the head? Yeah, if you shoot it in the legs, it falls apart, apparently. Alright, well, just shoot it in the uh, vulnerable bits, then. Not the... 
Okay. Don't don't green thing me. Can I shoot the green thing? Fresh radishes. <laughs> What's up, life in the crap lane? Get those radishes. Oh gosh. Oh man. Big old hitbox. Oh wow, this game is tough. All right, that's the first boss. Wowza. Oh, well, that's a nice place to let me continue. I thought it was going to make me start the level over. But I guess not. Yeah. Dead indeed. I kind of like this weapon better than the one that went up and down, though. The one that went up and down was a little too... Whack a doodle for my taste. I like me a straight shooter, you know? <sighs> Don't sword me, bro. At least it has the courtesy like turn around super slowly. Wow, it has 80 million hit points though. Oh, that was my bad. What happens if I run behind that? Do they face the other way? I guess I can test that really easily down here. Ah! Don't! Leave me alone! Ah! Oh, <laughs> that was close. Ah. Whoops, I didn't mean to break you apart, bro. I wasn't trying to do that, all that. I was trying to shoot you in the head. Yeah, I, I like that. Oh, gosh. Okay. Grandpa Skeletor here? Yeah. Oh, is that it? Wow, that seemed to go faster than... Young man, you better go back here. Do you think that you can return alive once you go into this island? You must regret it later. I probably should have read the manual for this game, huh? What level am I on now? I didn't read it. Looks like maybe we gotta climb vertically. There's some... We got Donkey Kong up there? What's a... Oh, a shield! Now we are talking! And now I got, what, double? Oh no, I accidentally wasted my entire shield on that thing. Oh, now I'm back to just these little lamos. Oh man. Oh. Whoop! Whoops! I was busy goofing around. Are we boned? Yeah, we're boned. I wonder if there's limited continues in this game. Um, I was like drifting down. Did we all see that? Why was that happening? Oh, if you hold up after jumping, you, like, drift down slowly. That's interesting. So I can, like, glide a little bit. Ah, oh, whoops. Oh, brother. That's maybe not the way to do that. Gosh, what I wouldn't give for some... some Contra-style aiming. <laughs> Game. Yeah, I remembered it correctly. This game's super hard. Uh, it's like Contra, but you have one life. Alright. Konami code. Oh, this game wasn't made by Konami. Two of... Mm. Maybe I should just jump up and grab it and jump back down, huh? Oh, man. All right, well, that's three continues so far. Oh, 
Oh, that's right, you can jump on stuff. I keep forgetting you can jump on stuff. Oh, you can't start gliding once you're already, like, in the air, maybe? Alright. Yeah, let the, uh, the blue grenades take care of this thing. Oh gosh, never mind. Let's let running away take care of this thing. Oh, look, my shots got taller. Is that the music, or is that my gun making that noise? Alrighty, now we're talking. Boss time again. Are we fighting the tree or is something coming out of that tree? Go that way? Oh, thanks, Torble. Okay, there's a, a dragon. I feel like I'm not hitting you. There we go. Get pwned! Young man, you better go back here. Do you think that you can... That's the same message you gave me after I beat the last one. Woods. Okay, so we built ruins and hill, maybe? I don't know what that second one was called. And woods. Oh, baby. What's that one do? Wow, I really gotta find out. Did that just kill everything on the screen? What weapons are... I, oh, I thought you were just gonna fly by, man. I know you're gonna do all that. Get the shield. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Jump, bro. I couldn't jump for some reason the second time. Okay, our... Gosh, how many power-ups did we get? I'm super glass cannon here. <laughs> I should have proceeded a little slower, I guess. Bro, why didn't you spawn earlier? Don't lick me, bro. I swear, I'm keeping this gun this time. It's easier to hit with. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Wow, that's quite a tongue you have there. Very impressive. Okay, I kind of do wish I'd picked up that second one now. Give me a checkpoint. That'll do. Boss? Oh man, am I going to regret not bringing that other power up? I need to hit those things on the top? Okay, no, those are just going to fall. I don't know where to shoot this thing. Okay, what was that? Four continues? I haven't been keeping good track. <laughs> Somebody keep track for me. Oh! Not my best jump. How far back could I go for power-ups? Oh, I guess not far, because there's not going to be a bridge to come back on. Oh, I can't jump on bats, apparently. I guess if I jump on the bridge, I can jump back on the bits I leave for myself, provided I can jump. Hmm. Is that going to take me back a checkpoint? Hmm. 
one-way street when it comes to checkpoints, I guess. Ah! <laughs> Alright, let's not get greedy. Let's just get the one. Okay, okay, game, cool it. We got the little heat seeker, so those are those are those are useful. We always love a good heat seeker, don't we? Didn't Mortal Kombat have a tree like that boss you just faced? Mortal Kombat? When did Mortal Kombat have a tree boss? I don't remember. It must have been like a much later Mortal Kombat than I'm familiar with. Mortal Kombat. The only Mortal Kombat we've played so far on stream was Mortal Kombat 1. And it didn't have no tree boss. Like, would it work better if I slowed down the turbo? We have... Doesn't really make a difference. All right, let's see if those little, ah, gosh. See if the little red things. Bro. Man. All that way. Come on, you can do it. There we go. <laughs> Dang it. Up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, BA, select, select, start. Oh, that would do two player. Well, there do seem to be unlimited continues. So that's that's helpful. Or <laughs> I really want the heat seeker. I don't understand this bridge at all. Sometimes it seems like I can walk on it. Sometimes it seems like I can jump on it. Sometimes none of those things. All right, there we go. Oh boy. Oh! Just land on its head, man! Be doo be doo be doo be doo be doo. Oh, you go vroom! Bat? Okay. Now we got heat seekers. Good, 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 good. Put that tongue away, mister. Uh! Hmm? Oops, my phone is acting super funny. Go back, thing. What have you done? Phone, thank you. There we go, okay. Phone being weird, it's okay, it's all good now. I think this time we'll just run through the door. There's a lot of them and they look very sc Can't! I was going to say they look very scary, but they're apparently harmless. Nope. Just kidding. Whoa, thank you, little heat seeker. That thing saved my life right there. All right, let's kill every stinking tongue monster in the game. Whose idea was this? Alright, now we make a break for it. Okay. Well, let's see where the little heat seekers go so we know where to shoot this tree thing. They're not doing anything. 
Oh, okay, it's just the mouth. Alright, so if we just... Don't... Oh, get hit by the little droppy blobbies. We should be pretty good, huh? Did I find, like, magic pixel here? I don't think it can hit me right here. Well, that's nice. As long as I don't, like, panic or freak out. Unless it starts a new kind of phase. New move here. This fight will be over in approximately five years. There's gotta be a better way. But we're going with the chicken way. Cheese it indeed. I never imagined that you could come this far, but much fiercer creatures will block your way from here. Can you... I can't read that fast. Statue. Is this the whole game? Is the game like five levels long? Because I'm on board with that. Ooh, ooh. That thing spit something at me. Oh, gosh, gross. Is this another climbing level? Yeah, it is. Oh, rude. They're like, they're like blowing little snot rockets at me. Oh, gosh. Oh, you can jump on their heads, though. Okay. Does this thing do anything? Oh, yeah, it sure does. Asking ye shall receive. Fireball in the tuchus. Oh, gosh. <laughs> there we go. Okay. But you can, like, kind of stun lock them, maybe? Oh, boy. Can I grab that without... Mm. Illinois been having some weird all weather. Two days ago was sunny, 70 degrees. Morning, that plunged to 20 degree hot. Wow, life in the crap way. We've been having weird weather like that over here too. Last Saturday, it was like bright and sunny. I think it was maybe like 60 degrees out. Lovely. And then we had like a flood warning on Monday. And today it was snowing. Like, okay, weather, whatever. We accidentally turned the weather onto rando. Ah. Oh, I wanted that. It seems like these climbing levels are kind of short, but they don't have checkpoints. Was this just like a straight up arcade game that they ported? Otherwise, it's hard to account for it being so short and difficult. If it is indeed that short. For all I know, this is like the first map of several. Okay, that's the little grenades. <laughs> I don't know why. I thought that thing was constrained to shooting on a plane. Okay, stop bouncing on it. Whoop. Oh, wow, that one shot again really fast. I thought I could kill it before it shot again. I was hoping I could mess with it, but I thought without getting messed back, but I guess not. There's no way that was ever going to be remotely safe. <laughs> I guess if I jumped down to the right and then to the left, I could be fine. Glover for the N64 had two levels that were short. One with only one checkpoint, the other with none. Wow. 
It's, it's all right. Like, I'm I'm not being super duper careful as I could be. I'm not frustrated yet. Um, I mean, still got nothing like battle toads. <laughs> this kind of feels like um, Ninja Gaiden E. The game was pretty difficult, but Infinity continues, at least in the first one. From what I understand, later Ninja Gaidens do not have Infinity continues, or maybe it was just the third one that didn't. And that really cranks up the difficulty on you. Games like this don't don't super bother me because it's always like I I always know how to beat the game. There's nothing like confusing about this. I just gotta, you know, just do it. Oh gosh. Okay. Am I, I'm hitting that thing from there. How funny is that? It looks like I am. Yeah, I sure am. Oh, it's eating my shield. There we go. Now I'm hitting it. Okay. Nice. Alright, now we got the upgrade. Let's see if we can one-shot this boss like we did the last climby boss. Oh man, my shield is sure uh, disappearing. Okay. Just do it. Okay. Got some twin boulder throwing dudes. Oh gosh. Oh boy. Okay, I can break the boulders. Oh wow, that's tough. Hey, what's up? Oh, Nike trademark. What's up, Turbo? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Make it do it makes us harder, better, faster, stronger. All right, let's see. What am I working on? All right. So, recently, I finished... You can still hear the music. That's cool. Creepy continue music. We finished a little Princess Leia. And a little Han Solo Amigurumi dolls. For a couple of nerds who... Princess Leia's buns are... Well, they're movable, so they can be wacky. It's fine. They, they move a little bit. This is for a couple of nerds who are getting on mar married on May 4th. If you get married on May 4th, you get a Star Wars present. Plus, I already had a pattern for... Han and Leia, since I made them for a different pair of nerds who got married on May 4th. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Princess Bunhead. Is that what she was called in that Thumb Wars? That Steve Odekirk made for TV thing? <laughs> wow. Pulled that out of nowhere. Yes, I have a question. How come we all have British accents when we're from space and there is no Britain? Uh, we're also working on a scarf I started today. This is a new pattern that I've never tried before called the basket stitch. It's going to be like a like an infinity scarf. It's much bigger when it comes off the round needles. It's on the, the round needles right now, so it looks kind of small. But this will this will fit comfortably around a neck once it's off there. Also, it's knit, so it's very stretchy. Black Helmet Man. <laughs> That's funny. I felt silly even asking that. I was like, is anyone even going to know what Thumb Wars is? But of course, of course, not only did some one, some two knew. Yeah, ooby doob scooby doob boo dooby Yeah, I remember that one. <laughs> this is just me trying to get rid of some yarn. I have some yarns that are like... They're different from my standard yarns, so I'm trying to get rid of them. So this is the scarf. I'm just just making it just to be rid of yarn. It doesn't have an intended, uh, what do you say, recipient, addressee in mind. And then finally, I have one of these little, it's one of these little metal foldy dealy things where you fold the metal and you build a metal earth. You build a little monster or a spaceship or whatever. This one's the uh, Purple Banshee from Avatar. I got it when I was in Disney World. We rode the uh, Avatar ride. 
and I liked the Avatar ride, so I wanted a, a souvenir to remind me of it. So I'm going to do one of these little things where you fold the little tabs and build a little metal sculpture. It's not really a craft, but I guess it's kind of a craft. I mean, it's in my craft bag. Anyway, thanks for the uh, redemption there, Turbo. Man, those rev Avatar rides were great. Let's get back to uh, Legend of Hero Tonma. Oops, I just kicked part of my computer off. Okay. Ooby doob, Scooby Doo, Bulooby. He has the he has the silliest name in the galaxy. That's right. Man, I gotta watch Thumb Wars. I actually was thinking recently about doing space balls for my movie night. Um, wondered if my kids would like it. Um, oof. But tomorrow, it's actually tomorrow is my movie night. Sounds like we're changing hats. And um, tomorrow for my movie night, we're going to do Mystery Science Theater 3000, the movie. All right, let's go change my hat. I don't even know what hat is next. Let's pull up my hat list. While I get repeatedly murdered. Beep, 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 beep. Okay, next hat, here we go. Yeah, this island earth. I haven't seen that one in a long, long time, but I thought that would be fun. <laughs> That's the one where he goes, acting, right? I still like say that to this day. Acting. Man, you can't even see that I'm wearing headphones now. But I'm not even sure which MSC3K that's from. <laughs> we didn't actually like own the movie. We recorded them all off of Comedy Central and then Sci-Fi ourselves. Or like, you know, my brother-in-law recorded them or something for us. But my, um, I think we rented the movie once and my my best friend's family owned the movie on VHS. So I saw it a couple of times, but it was not like the MST3K I saw the most. That was probably like Time Chasers or maybe Horror at Party Beach. I saw those ones a bajillion times. <laughs> this is your dishwashing liquid. You oh, soak in it. That's rich. Eat at Joe's. Eat at Joe's. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, passed around tapes. <laughs> so we watched most of them. The first one I ever saw was, um, I think, the giant Gila monster. Back when it was Joel Hodges or Hodgman or Hodgson. The guy who created it. Joel something. Hodgson, okay. I was in, I was in the area. I think I may have even said Hodgson just now. This wig sucks. I hate this thing. I'm taking it out of the hat lineup. <laughs> okay. I was more, you know... We we saw a lot more of the Mike Nelson ones. I haven't seen any of the the new ones. Like I think Netflix made some, but I haven't seen any of those. Um. All right. Where were we last? Okay. Why do baseball pitchers stay away from caves? This joke is so stupid. Why do baseball pitchers stay away from caves? Oh, jeez. This doesn't even make sense. This joke is senseless and ridiculous. Why do baseball pitchers stay away from caves? Because 
they're afraid of bats. Because they're afraid of bats. Why are baseball pitchers afraid of baseball bats? So how does that joke work? They're not afraid of baseball bats, so why would they be afraid of flying mammal bats? It doesn't make any sense, joke book. That's a terrible joke. Uh, there's nothing to get. That joke's awful. Thanks for the redemption, and I'm sorry. The Creeping Terror? I don't know if I remember that one, or if I even saw it. I definitely, like, never saw all of them. That one sound. that name sounds familiar, though. The Creeping Terror. Whoa. Did I actually just effectively duck an attack? Didn't know I had it in me. Gosh. And I thought maybe I would show him like Time Chasers or Horror Party Beach just because those are the ones I saw the most, but I think probably the movie is like the more approachable one. And weirdly enough, I think the movie is shorter than the TV shows. <laughs> Figure that one out. Oh my gosh. This game is flipping hard. But at least we got Infinity Continues. So it's still easier than Battletoads. Difficulty-wise, it kind of feels like Adventure Island, I guess, but um, the, it seems like it's going to be shorter than Adventure Island was. Of course, Adventure Island seemed like it was going to be shorter than it was, too. The game was shockingly long in the end. They just kept reusing the levels and just adding stuff to them. you from there? Nice. Don't jump up into me or anything like that, piggies. Found a safe spot. <laughs> Can't find it, huh? That's alright. Ash, at this point, you could just wait till you get your second craft. Oh, excellent. We're hitting this thing with these bombs. We're gonna cheese it all the way to the boss here. Oh! Okay. I don't know how I didn't lose some of my shield there, but that was nice of the game. I don't know what their projectiles are hitting, but I'm glad it's not me. Speaking of... Attention, everyone! The GERD367 has completed craft quest. Behold the wisdom and tenacity that have brought them this great accomplishment. The GERD boldly demanded to see the hidden treasures of Mickey Dadrad, endured his torturous jokes, forced him to change his hat, and play one of their games for a change. The GERD made unlikely allies along the way, including two precious trash cats and Mona Lisa Pupperstein. Mooj was also there. The GERD will forever have their own unique herald ring out as they enter the Hall of Heroes with their precious Psyduck treasure in tow. Mickey Dadrad will now commemorate the GERD's greatness with a craft of their choice. So some of that's not all exactly true because you were grandfathered in from Beanie Quest, but that's okay. We'll get all the other stuff on number three craft quest. Do me a favor there, GERD, and type uh, exclamation flex. Swag. Oh, 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 baby. Two little Psyducks. 
Sweet. All right. So you're going to have to let me know what you want for your sign back and what you want for your craft. And you're going to have to wait 100 years for it because I got a backlog apparently. No, I, got, I, I just ordered the stuff to make Brandon's craft today. Um, should be here tomorrow. And I don't imagine it'll take forever. It'll take longer than it should because, you know, I'm me. <laughs> That's very exciting. I'm very happy for you, Gerd. I'm glad you liked your first craft so much that you wanted another one. A Psyduck. Either playing Blitzball. Nice. All right. But just so you understand, if Psyduck plays Blitzball, it's probably going to play it wrong. Just, just FYI. Psyduck does most stuff wrong. Good. Love the hat. Yeah, obviously we'd be bad at the game. <laughs> or accidentally good at it. Those are the, the two Psyduck possibilities. Tragically bad, accidentally good. Oh gosh! Whoa, that one was close! Okay. Doki doki. Ha, huh, okay. There we go. Okay. Now, we've got Boulder Bros here. Ooh. Oh man, my neck got kind of stiff there. Alright, should we just like try and super pwn one right off the bat? Where did my shoe go? Oh, okay. Or just, you know, get smooshed immediately. <laughs> Can I jump on the rocks? That might make, my, make me feel a little safer. All right, so that's for your Psyduck. What do you want for your craft? Ah. I changed the little banner down there to show some of the kind of stuff I can make, but I guess um, it doesn't show everything I could potentially make yet. And um, honestly, like, depending on what kind of thing you want might change how I think it would be best to make it. Like, Brandon here wanted a yarn Game Boy. So, I'm going to make a plastic canvas Game Boy for him. I've never done a plastic canvas uh, cross stitch, but I thought that would be a that would lend itself well. Plus, it'd be fun to make my first plastic canvas cross stitch. Ah! Oh, they're destroying my shield. Oh, I hadn't thought that far ahead, huh? Or are there bullets hitting the wall? No, I don't know what's going on. That's cool, that's cool. Ain't no hurry at all. Why does everything that I fight take 50 shots from me, and I take one shot from everything? Yeah, that's too many, too many beanies, bro. You don't need any more of those. <laughs> but get you a little stuffy, maybe like a pillow. Um, ow! Um. I think I have a picture there of an Among Us pillow I made. Maybe a cross stitch.
Yeah. Uh, 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 uh. Uh oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't do that. <laughs> Bruh. Boo boo. Boo boo. You know a lot of yarn crafters, Skurd. That's pretty awesome. <laughs> Just can't turn over a rock without I. I mean, it's someone else who just loves making stuff out of yarn. The sixth person. Wow. Wow, I'm so not special at all. That's okay. I'm surprised there aren't more people who make stuff out of yarn. When my mother would do it, everyone would be like so amazed at all the stuff she made. She's like, it's so easy. Literally anybody could do it. And we all just thought she was being modest. And then I started making stuff out of yarn. I was like, nah, she was telling the truth. This is super easy. But I was just saying the other day that, um, especially like watching a bunch of these like console modding videos where they're doing a bunch of solder, that it seems like people use difficult as a synonym for takes a long time. Because they'll say this thing's really hard, but what they really mean is it's going to take you a while to do. Yeah! Final Fantasy X stuff. That is special. Okay, let's wait for the rock. Oh, whoa! He threw that rock super weird. Okay, you can bounce off rocks. That's good. Okay, so we're just focusing on rock dodging. Whatever hits they take are going to be kind of collateral. That's all right. You can kill the rocks. Dang, they, they, they got the man, they, they threw them both at the same time. I should have ducked under the one and then jumped over the other, but I wasn't thinking clearly enough. Um, I did not want to do any of that. <laughs> Game. What hit me? Hmm, disagree. Cheese it. Should I come back for this later? Man, I could love a, I, would, I would love a pizza right now. <laughs> oh, 
Oh! Uh, stop eating my shield, bro! Okay. I got two little shields left. I don't know if they're any use at all against the boss. I feel like the second they touch a rock, they'll be gone. Whatever it is, it's 20 times heavier than a boot. Yeah, it's... My shield's getting eaten by... That don't sound like no golden mama said I ever heard. Okay, so you can kind of tell which one's going to go first based on their appearance, so I can... I can time that up a little bit better. Alright. Okay, you can stop bouncing around now, Tonma. At least I think I'm Tonma. I really should have read the manual for this game so that I would know anything about it. I mean, it's, it, I'm doing all right. Like, I will go read the manual after. Between streams. I'll, I'll figure out this game. Probably won't be many surprises in it. Gosh, I wonder how powerful your weapons can get if you don't, like, lose them in between levels. Or wait, did I keep my upgrades between levels? I don't even remember. Okay, don't put your sprite in the enemy. Oh, hello, my little. We have a handsome fella here. He walked up and rubbed up against my leg. He said, hey, I'm trapped in here. You want to let me out? You're very sweet. You're sweet, handsome boy. But no, I'm not going to let you out. You're on your own. Heartless. Hey, what's up, Sepulcher? Yeah, free little, free little kitty show. Some free mittens. Oh, don't go back there. He's messing with my stuff. Hey, hey. Psst. Mona Lisa, Mona oh boy. Lisa. Here we go. We'll give it a try. Actually, she's in bed right now, so this should be just fine. We shouldn't have any. I think that's the first time I got hit by that fire. All right, let me see. One second, life in the crap lane. I'll go get your baby. Wait, 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 wait. Mona, come here, Cam, here's Mona Lisa. She's a little freaked out. She was sleeping and we woke her up. She's like, hey, why am I out of my bed? Plot twist, Tonma is only a pseudonym the hero uses because Tonma spelled backwards is am not. <laughs> the beagle has graced us. She's sleepy beagle. Hey, baby. Hey. This is Mona Lisa Pupperstein. She is named after Mona Lisa Saperstein. And she is perfect. In every way, anything can be perfect. Even if she is a bit of a pea beagle. Oh, little baby. Oh, you hear her? You woke me up. I was sleeping. I had such a comfy pillow in Mooch. She always sleeps just like on Mooch. Like, no regard at all for whether or not he wants it. Although, he kind of likes it. Oh, life in the crap lane is sorry, but not that sorry. Hey, sweetie. He's blurry. <sighs> she is adorbs. Oh, my gosh. She's so good. Um, and now Mellow High is rubbing up against my leg all jealous. Even though he doesn't like being picked up. Hey, hey, nope, never mind. He's attacking my Turbo Graphics controller cord. Bro loves eating cords. In fact, he loves eating cords so much, I gotta fix my rock band, rock band drum set bass pedal because he chewed through the cord. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. She's Beagle. She doesn't have as big a blaze as Frank or Z, though. She's got like a kind of a small, asymmetrical blaze. She's a classic tricolor. She's... Uh, 
Her dad's name was Hercules, and her mom's name was Squiggles. And both of her, her mom and dad were very cuddly, as is she. And very kissy. <laughs> she doesn't know why she's here. But she's mostly okay with it. Oh, you got me. You got me. You sneaky. You sneaky kisser. All right, you want to make some squishy noises? Oh, man. She does not want to make squishy noises. Sometimes if you squish her a little bit, she'll go, oh, oh, oh. But this time she just kind of squeaked like a squeaky toy. Mm. Oh, there we go. I got a little honk out of her. Okay. Ready to go back to bed? Okay. I think she's going to go back to bed. Thanks for the redemption. That was you, Life in the Crap Lane, right? Thanks for the redemption, whoever it was. <laughs> Let's put this baby to bed. BRB? I tried to let Mello out, but he wouldn't go. What the time is it? Nine o'clock? All right, we'll give this a few more tries. Oh man, I gotta brush this wig. <laughs> when I mash it in the drawer there, it gets all tangled. <laughs> Hello, Mello. Yes, I know. Bro is super fake affectionate right now. Keeps rubbing up against me, but really what he wants to do is leave. You could put Torgo's theme on top of the game music. <laughs> What's up, Shadow and Shadow Raiders? My name is Mickey Dadram. I take care of kids, I play old video games, and I make stuff out of yarn. Tonight's old video games have been Tetris, Fallums, which is not an old video game, and now we're playing Legend of Hero Tanma for the TurboGrafx-16 tonight. It says you were playing Donkey Kong Country 2. Were you doing the two-player mode again? Hey, Future Brush and Computer MD82 and Sots. Welcome, welcome. How did the Donkey Kong Country 2 go? A bit more progress? Uh-huh, uh-huh. We getting better at it? Is it still super hard? Good old co-op, yeah, yeah. This game's super de duper de hard. But apparently I have infinity continues, so it's okay. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Alright. This is kind of like Contra-y, sort of. You get these little power-ups and you shoot better weapons and stuff. And you die in one hit. Still hard, huh? You gonna do some co-op speedruns? I've gotten to the boss of this level a couple times. Kinda know how to beat it. Just gotta execute better and stuff, you know? Oh gosh! What have we done? Ah! 
<laughs> Probably not. <laughs> No good, it's full of steam. <laughs> that wasn't a serious question. <laughs> Is there a, a co-op category for speedrunning Donkey Kong Country 2? Oh, I'm hitting that thing above me off screen. That's nice. Let's just destroy it while it's off screen. See if we can do this one too. Yeah, look at that. The Chippendale co-ops. Oh, okay. That's true. Chippendale. Yeah, that makes sense. All right. So whichever one, these guys are gonna throw rocks at me, and whichever one spawns first throws the first rock. Wow, I, I destroyed that rock. And they kind of. No, oh, there goes my shield. They kind of throw it at where you are, but not necessarily perfectly every time. I'm mostly just focusing on not dying <laughs> and letting my attacks hit them when they will. <laughs> oh gosh! You can bounce off the rocks if you can get up that high. If I were a little more composed, I could probably get more shots to hit them but it's all right it's like I'm always telling John as long as I'm alive I can still play the game and there's no time limit here oh I got one got two yes it was a good luck raid Good for you! I never imagined you'd come this far, but much fiercer creatures will block your way from here. Can you surely save the legendary princess? I didn't know there was a legendary princess. All right, so that was level four. Now we're on dungeon. And I did now. <laughs> um, how do I get up there? Oh, is this another climbing level? Okay, there's some stuff up there I want to get. Oh my gosh, Mello is being such a baby. Okay, there's a key over here, and the princess is in another castle. Oh no, look at you whiny baby. Go away from me, bro. Oh, these things are buff. Ah, bats! Okay, but I have the key, so I can get in there now. Probably gotta go down here, huh? Oh, what's that thing? I've never seen one of those before. It, like, destroyed all those blocks. Wow, we've got little crawly missiles now. Those are new. There's a book? What's a book do? Man, I really ought to read the manual for this game. Power up there. Okay. Wow, we've got a lot of powers here. Uh, Future Rush is reminding me it wouldn't be quite like Chippendale Co-op. It would basically be like two play people playing the one-player game. Because you take turns, right? Like whoever's in front is controlling. I'm not even actually entirely sure how two-player Donkey Kong Country works. Um, I never had friends growing up. Hey! Hey! Just kidding. This guy is being such a punk, he's attacking my screen. Um... I just, I don't think I ever played a two-player. I, I felt like when I was a kid, I was the only one who liked that game. Because hmm. I, I like Donkey Kong. Donkey Kong is like my favorite. Hey. Hey. You miss your bro? Is that what happened? He got locked in here and he's been stuck with me all stream. He's not thrilled about it. All right, let's get tossed. Don't worry, over there, it's just a giant blender in the floor that he lands in. I'm kidding. He landed gently on my bed next to Popsicle, who hated it. Okay, so when I touch that little scroll there, it's going to make those blocks break. It makes some blocks break, anyway. Oh, boy. Okay, get the key. Oh, gosh. This... 
It's amazing how many powers I have, and I still don't even feel remotely safe. Okay, but those are checkpoints at least. Although, I'm not going to be taking all these power-ups with me. Okay, this is like a bat spawner from... Oh, bro. Good thing you are not a baseball... Pl oh, it was a pitcher. It was a baseball pitcher. <laughs> and yeah, good thing, I guess. <laughs> okay, here we go. Wow, I got... What did I get there? Oh, I got a shield. And I thought it disappeared immediately. It just disappeared for a second and then came back. So, can I destroy these things? It seems like I can't really jump on them. Maybe I can jump on them and I'm just being a chicken. It works a little different in Donkey Kong Country 2 than it did in Kisei 1. And the change was for the better. I don't know how it worked in 1. <laughs> okay, it looks like I can jump on that as long as there's not a bat actively coming out of it. And I should continue from that checkpoint there. Wow, this wig is super itchy. Oh, okay. Well, that's the way to do it right there. And that book kills everything on the screen. So the scroll kills the blocks. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Okay, well, that worked out weirdly. It worked out, though. Oh, I forgot these were down here. This should be, like, some kind of heat seeker. Added to my attack, and now I got a shield. Bruh. Okay, there we go. A heat seeker would be great, because then I could use it to shoot this thing. Yeah, oh, that's what we got. We got these grenades. I can throw up at it. Oh, your bullets can't go through the floor, and mine can? Fantastic. Let's do the same thing to you. All right. Okay, got a power up here. Little vampires. Oh gosh. Well, there went my shield. Not even sure if that was worth it. Okay, gotta like jump off of this one at the. a little later than that. Ugh. I'm presuming that's what you want me to do, ranking? I can't jump that high. These guys are just going to keep on coming. Um. I don't know how to make this jump. <laughs> this jump can't be made. And gosh, I'm going to die as soon as I go down in there anyway. Maybe I'm not going the right way. Maybe I missed something over here? No. Definitely supposed to go this way. Just, we got some like weird pixel perfect jump we gotta make. Yeah, let's... Once you have fallen, you definitely can't jump anymore. Ugh. Oh, that's right, I forgot you can like glide down in this game. I don't know what possible good I can do with that. Wow, what a weird place to get stuck in the game. wall boss. Oh, you know what I'm probably supposed to do? I'm probably supposed to bounce off one of these. Come here. There we go. There! Okay, that's that's all it is. Oh, brother. That wasn't salubrious. Ah, okay. Solved the mystery. Whew. Oh, boss time. Um, oh, wow, that's not what I was... Ex is that the legendary princess? No, that's just some weirdo who lives in your mouth. Alright, well, let's go bullet hell versus bullet hell. See who wins. There's no way that was the boss of the game. All the monsters are annihilated. The story of your brave rescue of the princess will be handed down through generations as a splendid legend? Okay, that's what I thought. Enjoy your lurk. I'm feeling a little tired, a little hungry myself. Hey, and this cat keeps attacking my stream setup. Get out of there, you. Bro is about to unplug my turbo graphics. He is so mad at me. Oh, 
Oh, bless you. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm just panicking. What's that thing? Is that an extra... Can I fly now? What was that? It was like a little ton my head with wings. Oh my gosh. Okay, speed run. I got to the boss in one try. Oh boy. What do we have here? Oh man. I was doing so good too. Oh. Bummer. All right. Can I get all those power-ups again? It's a start. What's in this chest? A book that kills everything. Okay. What? Never saw that creature before, or I killed it so fast last time I didn't notice it. Okay, so those little gremlins fly out of those broken windows. Okay, I stun locked at that time. Oh, no, I spawned another one. Could we maybe stop spawning those? <laughs> Actually, I wonder if that... Whoa! Why did it go with the screen? Okay, there's a power up there. That's super weird that those things move with the screen. I see a lot of enemies do that in games. Oh, pfft, of course don't stand right in front of the little doorway. Alright, this will be the last one. If we beat it, awesome. If not, we'll beat it next time. I think. Wish I could pick up that book, take it with me, and choose when to use it. Oh, alright. Well, fun game. Let's uh, get some bonus radishes. Creepy music. Thanks for the raid channel. Thanks for hanging out, everybody. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, wow. Base Camp Foster. What's she doing on so late? Let's go. Oh, she's finishing a video game. She's finishing. Okay, hush ad. Stop talking on my stream, Ad. Nobody wants to see Dune. Oh, Dune Part 2. Everyone go see Dune Part 2. <laughs> uh, say hi to uh, Big Chungus fan for me. We call her Big Chungus fan. So just say hi, Big Chungus fan. She'll know what it means. <laughs> okay. Give me the shortest lurk ever. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out, everybody. And have a good night.